Early Confederate victories gave the South confidence that they would triumph in the Civil War. However, by 1863, the South had experienced a number of major defeats. In May of that year, Stonewall Jackson died after being wounded at the Battle of Chancellorsville, Virginia. Within two months, the Battle of Gettysburg in Pennsylvania proved to be one of the bloodiest battles of the war, and the fall of Vicksburg effectively cut the Confederacy in half. Just as Southern confidence in the war effort began to falter, the victory by Confederate troops at Sabine Pass provided a much-needed boost to morale. In this context, the successful defense of Sabine Pass, where Dowling and his men achieved the victory with few resources, while the Union suffered a large defeat, was almost unimaginable. President Jefferson Davis praised the Davis Guard, calling them marvelous and without parallel in ancient or modern war. In the North, weariness with the war and the Confederate victory led many to believe the South to be unconquerable. Eventually, General Ulysses S. Grant provided victories that led to the Union's success in the Civil War. 